Hey guys, thank you so much for clicking on to another DOY Creation 7 video. Welcome back to everyone. Okay guys, I got a few items that I would like to share with you guys today. But before I get started, you know I always like to give glory, honor, and praise to the Most High Yah. So I got my mic on guys. So let me know in the comments, do you guys hear me a lot clearer or what? Because... I'm not for sure. I got it plugged in, but not sure if it's actually working correctly or it's, you know, you're hearing me better or what, but the whole objective is to, you know, make sure you guys are able to hear me and see me pretty well. So, okay, guys, um, I told you guys I was going to be right back. I am going to be pumping these videos out to you guys, sharing with you guys what I have been working on, why I was on my holy day. So guys, one of the things that I was working on, um, but before we get started, you know, I always like to give glory, honor, and praise to the Most High Yah. The, one of the things I was working on is I have a new member. Yes, guys, I went on and purchased her right here. Isn't she adorable? This one is called the uh, Sparks Image. This one is the Flush Animal. So I have her right here. And this is the little skirt. Cody, I'm not sure exactly what do you call um, this that goes over them. I have been calling them the skirt. So this is the newest member. And I thought she looked absolutely adorable. I was trying to match up the yarn that went with her eyes, that teal color, and her little bow, which is that teal color. So I made a, another one of these to go around her. So I do have the tutorial, guys, that I'll be loading right after this video. Uh, I already did the tutorial on how to make this one right here to go around the little stuff little um animals so that one will be coming to you guys right after this one for those who are interested in making your own however these are available um for sale and they're not on the website you will have to email me and i can send you over a secured paypal invoice so you can get this one shipped out. But this is the red heart yarn and stripes. And that is that. Another item that I have been working on, guys, is I made a granny square uh, bag. So here is the bag. So what I need to do with this one here is I just need to line it. It's not lined yet. But I made the uh, the square and the variegated zebra yarn in the center. Then I outlined it in black. But if you turn the back over, I made the center black and uh, outlined it with the zebra. Okay. Which is so, so cute to me. So, uh, so cute. And then I, I didn't want to worry about, even though I got some handle that's coming some um purse handle that will be coming to me really soon i went on and just crocheted me a nice thick long handle and around the edges i did the peacoat stitch and i'm just going to add a button to close this one here but yeah i liked it how i just alternated the two yarns to create that nice bag right here so it definitely is a nice size to go right over yourself how cute is that so once I line the bag you guys could be able to um you know you could put more items inside the bag so it is a nice bag so those were the two items that I have completed what I have on my crochet hook, some of you guys are going to be super excited about it. Mm, 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 mm. 
is this here, guys. I am in the process of the tutorial on my fat bottom bag. So I am working on mines in gray. And this is how it's looking so far. Yep, with the bubble stitch. I really like how this looks. So I was doing the tutorial. It's on pause right now. And I will have this video loaded for you guys this week. Um, I should have this one loaded for you guys this week as well. So go ahead, guys, and have your two strands of yarn. Uh, the crochet hook that I'm using is a number nine. So make sure you have your acrylic yarn, four-ply yarn, and also your letter nine crochet hook because this is what I have on whip. I am doing the tutorial as we speak. So, okay, guys, that is what I got on crochet hook, or that is what I got on whip, and those are the items that I uh, completed. Like I said, with the little skirt, I already got that tutorial completed. I will be uploading that one right after this one here. I just wanted to show you that before I actually did the tutorial on it but yeah guys that is what i've been up to i really like this bag right here and it doesn't take a lot of yarn to create these bags so you guys will be seeing me coming back using up some more of my yarn oh that'd be nice in that size right there using up some more of my yarns with these little bags right here so stay tuned to see what other uh colors I'll be making uh, these bags they really really simple it's just a granny square on the front a granny square on the back and then you just sew the granny square up if you need me to do a tutorial on how to make this bag right here please leave it in the comments and the bag is simple enough that I can definitely do a tutorial on that as well it's just that simple all right, guys, uh, until next video, I think that's it. That's all I got for you guys. So until next video, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. You can definitely share if you want to. That would be so, so awesome if you do. All right, guys, until next video, always remember y'all some 68.4 in your King James Version. Always keep your life and your health in check. And I'll be checking you guys in the next video really, really soon. All right. Bye for now.